Welcome to the FC24 Ultimate Team Speed Run, where I take a brand new account with no money spent to try and get 11 wins in foot champs in the shortest time possible. I'll post my time here as a benchmark, and if you guys want to try this challenge as well, you can tweet me what time you did it in over on Twitter or any other socials, and the links, of course, as always, are down below. And as always, we start with picking our kits and badges, and then go straight into the grind. Champs quality points. Man, I didn't want to see this message yet. That means we are going to have to spend time in rivals because I needed to unlock rivals first and I haven't. We have zero points. Nil pois. Silly from EA. But that's all right. We're going to we're gonna get it done right into the store for the first thing that we've got going on. All Tots welcome pack. 83 plus rare gold player pick straight away. Some loan icons, an ambassador and a team of the season loan. That's all right. Load, load me in, EA. Load me in. You're telling me the game's crashed already. We're not even a minute in. Here we go. What do we get? Okay, we'll take an 85. All right. Base hero loan number one. Go with uh, Ricardo Carvalho. Base hero loan number two. Brilliant. Where's my stuff? Where's my player picks gone? I just lost it. What a start. What a start. Oh, my days. It's... it's I know how to play the game, EA. The reason why the start of these series takes so long all the time is because EA think that this is your first time looking at technology in your life. All right, here we go. Back into the pick. The icons. Oh, we'll take a little 24 game loan, Eric Cantona. Why not? And we'll go with, uh, we'll go with Vinny J, actually. And then. Yeah, we'll take uh, Sobo Sly as well. That's not a little bad, uh, bad little start for the uh, for the grind. To be fair, it's not quite a five k kit, but it's all right for some coins. Wow, I thought the Ajax kit would have sold for a fair bit. To be fair, but I guess I was wrong. So let's get these early SBCs done as well, just to start the ball rolling with getting certain things done, so that we could do like the the daily login and and such, get ourselves a few extra decent players. The other thing that I really want to do is look at some evolutions that we could put together straight away and get a decent player in. All right, that is that first SBC set done, which is great because it means we can move on to the proper things that we actually want. What is it, an 81 double? Yes, please. I want to be a man. Ah, Vasquez is okay. All right, the first thing we're going to do is just look at our squad real quick, put together what we can with what we've got so far, which honestly isn't even that bad off the jump. Um, all right, so I think first things first, let's 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 just get into some games. I need to go and get those uh, champs qualifier points. Let's go and get into some games with this team. On FC, game number one, here we go. Oh yeah, baby, this is what we need. Just don't be a PC hacker, that's all. This disconnect straight away, we modded. Yep, brilliant. All right, Lyon Assi. Yeah, that, I mean, that's better. That's better. All those loans, mind you, but that's better. I'd be surprised if this was a cheater. Right, like I said, I have to be ruthless. Cantona! There's one. Who knew Dominic Calvert-Lewin had it in him? Yes! All right, we'll play one more game, and then at the end of this game, we'll do an objectives run because we'll have the daily objectives, the daily play. All right, this guy's doing Evos. There's no way that this is a hacker or a cheater or a glitcher. I'm, I'm so expecting people to like be better at the game than they are. When actually they're all just really bad down here. So just take those three goals, baby. Oh, whoppa, there we go, come on. Dominic Calvert-Lewin makes it four, baby, come on. Oh, go, 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 go. Yes. Yes. <laughs> 15 was his limit. 15 was where he was like, I'm I'm leaving. Let's see. Let's have a little uh, little gander of the amount of objectives we have done now. The pro team stuff doesn't offer offer packs, so I'm not, not going to claim that. But the Galazzo goal master, 80 by 5. So, oh, I can get Sergei Milinkovic Savage, can't I? Oh, I should be working on that straight away as well, shouldn't I, really? I didn't even think. Best day as well. What do I need from best day? Nine games with three Germans. And for Milinkovic Savage, seven wins with two Saudis. Okay. 
Germans and Saudis. We need those. Is there another player available as well? No. Wait, how have I not got play three yet? I've got two wins and the first game should have counted. God damn it. All right, we'll play one more. We'll play one more before I open all of these packs. All right, Football Shirt Friday I want as well. I want to put this Tifo on. And then all of this as well will be good. The draft token as well, which will be uh, half decent once it comes. I tell you what, let's open these packs to get some players for it. It might actually help us by uh, might might actually help us by getting some players and whatnot. Argentina. Oh, none of that helps. Some chem styles in there though, which is all right. Seventy-eight by two. <laughs> now for an eighty-eight Griezmann, we got some options. Do we put him into the exchange and then build some player picks, or do we just use him? for a while especially in these low divisions and qualifiers he could be half decent right there's a Bun uh, German not Bundesliga it's Bundesliga Women's League isn't it which also gives some XP doesn't it hmm we have to have a little figure out here of what the uh... oh my days oh there's a Saudi League player let's go and a good uh, well a slow but half decent centre back that's alright an 80 by 2 Argentina the Paul oh he'll get uh, links to Griezmann. Another 80 by 2. And just let me see that blue straight away. Let me see that first blue EA. Get Lamar. Oh, wow, we're building that Atletico Madrid squad here. Another 80 by 2. All duplicate. Gotta throw him away. Imagine getting a duplicate to pull straight away. Another 80 by 2. Hey, where's my blues, man? Wambasaka and Calabria doesn't really help for the uh, for the cause. Another eighty by two. Like I said, about seven times in a row. Rams out. That's good because now I can put uh, Sheridan into the exchange. Eighty by five. No blue here. Luka Modric would be tidy. Oh, that is tidy. Oh yes, please. That Serge Gnabry is banging because he is going to be our Evo. That is an absolute pull, that is. That is an absolute pull. An 81 by 2. Trent and Hummels. Another German Bundesliga. Okay. We've, we've made some serious progress here. And then a 75 by 5. Aliano. At Cherby. All right. There's some serious progress made there. Let's go and submit our first evolution because I tell you what, that was a banger of a pickup from Serge Gnabry. Yes, it was. He's going to be amazing by the time he's finished. What do we need to do first? Play two and win two. Easy, easy. We need to put in two Saudi players, three German players and five Bundesliga players. So that is all bases covered. Let's go. Nice. What a goal. What a goal. Hey, goal. If that's gone in. There we go. Lovely jubbly. Yes, please, baby. Oh, didn't even fresh shoot. Just run it in. Just run it in. All right, what we will do at the back of that, now that we're up into Division 9 as well, is we will claim the daily rewards. Yeah, 10 objectives there. That's a lot. That can really, really be of an assistance to the team that can. We've got an 84 by 2 as well, which is quite nice. The daily play is done, and the daily play completionist gives us an 83 by 2. We've got some decent packs here, to be fair. What I'm looking for is Gabriel Martinelli. He'd be or or Cody Gakpo. One of those two would be nice to have in the team as the Premier League player. The Orban. He won by two. Italian. Duplicate Acerbi already. We get an 83 by two and an 84 by two. No blue. Weiberg and Oyarzabal. And an 84 by two. Come on, first blue. First blue. No, nope, never mind. Uruguay. Raujo. Not bad. Right, this guy's got a full goal squad with an inform. There's one from Serge Gnabry. Same pass. Wow. Come on, Paulson, lad. Oh, Shobos, lad. 
Abri, goal, 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 goal. Trying his luck, feeding it through. Oh, right. Crossing into the middle. Can he get the shot off? It must go in, surely. Yeah, you're getting cooked, mate. You're getting cooked. You're getting cooked. You're getting cooked. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. I've been the one. <laughs> It was good beating people that are way less skilled than you. It's just a massive ego boost, isn't it? Oh, we actually got loads of points for that win there. Okay. Okay, we, we did get loads of points for that win there. It won't take too long to get out of the rivals. Uh, out of rivals. Right, first things first. Serge Gnabry up to an 86. Two overall, three shooting, four passing, three dribbling, chip shot and press proven. Give me some of that. Then what we're going to do is a little bit of uh, an upgrade grind right now. All right. That is the four daily gold things done and a few other objectives, I believe. Yeah, an 80 by 10 from Galasso Goldmaster and a draft token from Explore Ultimate Team. Right, we get an 80 by 10. Give us our first blue. Nope. Oh, God damn it, it's max 84. Right, four of these gold players packs. Just Bundesliga players is all we need, really. Everything else is irrelevant. Right, let's build a Bundesliga team. Okay, we don't quite have 11 players yet. But what we'll do... We'll go to the SBC section. That's it. Bosh. And that will give us a full Bundesliga. Imagine I just hit a blue out of this. I didn't. Good. We now have enough Bundesliga players to finish up our squad. All right. Let's go into that cup. Just let this be comfortable. Yeah. Lovely. Keith's quitting. He's gone. He's gone. Right, there's one game, one win. Love that. Love that. Love that. Oh, he's gone. Yeah, that press proven on Nabry is banging. That's enough there. Let's go and get our first team of the season. That play three more for Kim Min Jae. Win three more for some XP. Score six more. But for how quick it is, it might. It might be worth doing it. Get Gertz and Royce in there and everything else I don't care about because it offers like trash rewards. But what I do care about is our first TOTS guaranteed pack. Do you know what? Obviously, I wouldn't mind getting like a huge TOTS card. But more than getting a really, really good... Well, aside from getting a really, really good one, getting a TOTS card with plus chemistry would be banging so that they can slot straight into the team, no problem at all. That's kind of like what I'd really like. All right, here we go. Our first team of the season card. Who we got? Havlovich. Does he have plus chemistry? I don't think he does. Doesn't. How is it? How have I managed to get a bad player that doesn't have good chemistry? Good news is we'll get a link with him once we get the uh, Malinkovic Savage right. Squad, Premier League this time. Is that full Premier League? Yes, it is. All right, let's go into that cup again. Vinny J, baby. Two more. Two more here to get another team of the season. Mitoma. Oh, oh, it's deflected in. There we go. Guy's moving his keeper in all sorts, man. Jesus. One back. He's got it back to 3 2. All right. Love that. Love that. Two in a row. Go on, Bob. Go on, Bob. There he goes. All right. That's three wins. All right. That's much, much nicer. Uh, objectives. Oh, 2,000 XP earned there as well. Gives us not a lot. Yeah, see, I don't... I, like, the XP levels, unless we can get 6,000 XP and get uh, Teze, the XP levels probably aren't worth <clears throat> farming. What have we got that's easy for XP? We get 500 there, 500 there, that's 1,000. It's kind of not worth it, is it? 2,500, 3,500, 4,500, 5,000, 6,000. Okay. It actually might be worth it might be worth farming the XP. We get Erdegaard and Hoyland there. 
Because if we if we farm the XP and get that Teze for the champs run, he'll be a cracking right back for us. All right, let's see what we get out of these packs. Mm, gold pack to start with. Yeah, six thousand is easy. I just need to keep move like I, I just need to keep like moving the squad around to get the XP in where where it needs to be. Like I need to put some like Bundesliga women in. I need to score some goals with English player. I think it is. I know he can play centre back. I won't need a centre back though. I'm already going to have uh, more and Pavlovic as centre backs. Another team of the season pack. Come on, EA. Bless me. Uh, do, do you know what I actually want more than anything out of this defender pack? Out of this team of the season pack is a left back. We seem to be like if we get Teze, we're going to have two good centre backs. We're going to be fully blessed with midfielders, no problem at all, and, and attackers, no problem at all. So either a goalkeeper or a full back would be good. Oh, Dybala 86. Love that. All right, here we go. Team of the season, number two inbound. Who are we going to get? Here? Come on, hook us up, baby. Austria. Centre mid. Eintracht Frankfurt. Dunst. Not a bad card, to be fair, for this series. Four-star, four-star. Great passing, great dribbling, good defending, good physical, good pace, great play styles. I don't mind that. I don't mind that. Now then, I want to farm this XP again. I need to play... Just play six more here. I need to win five more with two Saudi League players. And here I need to win five with five Bundesliga players and play nine with three Germans. I kind of, I guess I kind of want to go and finish off the ups then whilst I'm in a low division. But what we'll do first of all is we'll go and finish off the Premier League and Bundesliga friendly setup. And it did end up taking around 25 minutes in total, which was a lot more than I had hoped. But we finally got our three wins in the cup. That is that finish now. Doesn't really offer that much in terms of the packs either. The Joao Pedro could be quite nice though. And Football Shirt Friday is going to give us more as well. Great. After all said and done there, guys, this is the squad we're using. We've still got the three Germans, the two Saudi players, and the six Bundesligas. And we are going to go and get qualified for champs. Well, we're going to go and get points to get qualified for qualifiers of champs. And as we enter into the last few Rivals games for this video, guys, to get our Rivals qualification points, at the point of recording this video of, of like playing the games and such rather than it coming out because it's out probably about a month later after I actually did it, uh, thanks to mostly me and a bit of ill health. But at the point of recording this, we didn't, we weren't getting three champs quality points every week. And I know that we have done over, I think the last three weeks of team of the season, we've got three champs quality points each week. Um, which is great because, you know, I, I think in general, the whole system with how EA have got qualifiers, champs and rivals set up is just massively outdated and could do with a really huge overhaul. With that being said, one thing that has been a lot nicer this year is how easy it is to actually qualify as we get ourselves another upgrade on Serge Nabry there, but how easy it is to actually just qualify. We don't have to get up to like Division 5 anymore. No, it used to take so long to get qualification points in 10, 9, 8, 7, those divisions. But now you end up getting some really, really healthy ones. And actually, before the team of the season season started, we were getting weekly rivals objectives that were also giving qualification points. So I think EA really do realise and really recognise how certain aspects of this game are a bit archaic and a bit outdated compared to what they used to be when they introduced rivals and champs in like FIFA 17 and FIFA 18. But they, they, for me personally, they're doing it the wrong way around by putting everything in milestones or objectives or seasons or and, and things like that to kind of allow people to get what they should just have in the core game mode. So it'd be really nice if we maybe got a little, like, little refresh, little update on the game modes for next year. But for now, as I say, these were the final games that we needed to get those qualification points to allow us to go into foot champs. Right, that is us in uh, champs qualifiers at last. Welcome to the big leagues. Didn't take too many games, actually, just eight games. I think we still need to play one more with Serge Gnabry to get him evoed. What have we got to be handy for us? An 81 by 2. FC Pro we don't care about. Oh, we got 40 and 50. Oh, an 85 by 2 and an 81 by 11. That could be very tidy. Best day. So we still need to play three more to get best day done and win one more. And then we can get rid of these Bundesliga players. And then for Milinkovic Savic, we need to win one more, play two more, and score a header. So let's get these packs open. Maybe we can get ourselves a little something, something, man. And then what we'll do is uh, I'll play the one or two more that I need to play. 
to get Courtois. Tails. Yeah, to get the Milinkovic Savage and Jean Nicolas best day. Then we'll look at doing some SBCs that might improve the squad because then we'll be able to actually build the team and see what we're lacking and where we're lacking. And I think we should be able to have enough fodder to do like a couple of SBCs here or there. And then we'll do qualifiers with the formation set up as it is currently because it's just about getting those four wins as quick as possible. And once we finish qualifiers, we'll then set up a proper tactic, formation, custom tactics, things like that to go into champs with. 85 by 2 is not going to give us... Uh, ooh, 89 Morgan, let's go. Um, yeah, not going to give us a blue. Then an 81 by 11 is also not going to give us a blue. Wow, that is stinky, isn't it? All right, let's go and get our first qualifiers game. Now, oh, actually, do you know what? Someone coming up against that sort of team. But unless I see like a team like hyper meta. Oh, wow, that's cheese, isn't it? Unless I see a team that's hyper meta. I'm, I'm just confident I'll be getting that dub. Come on, I don't know how I've got my leg around the defender there, but I'll take it. Wait, what? I don't even know how he's got a penalty. All I wanted there was Pavlovich the whole time, and it just would not let me switch. Where does the game play down? Let's go, Rich. Come on. What a block. Come on. Great goal from Royce. I turned... See, see how this game, like, micro stutters? That's a delightful goal. Get us out of this game. Right, we should have completed an insane amount of really cool objectives there. We've also got our first win towards qualifying for champs, and we're only three and a half hours deep, which isn't bad. So first of all, we have finished Serge Gnabry. I'm really happy with this card. He's going to be great for us. I can feel it. What have we got available? We don't have a team of the season. Oh, do I? Nope, nothing there yet. Premier League tots. Probably just going to do Kai Havertz. Yeah, that Kai with a hunter could be still quite deadly. So we'll throw him in there. Um, in terms of the objectives, the Milinkovic Savage is nearly finished now. We need to score off of a header and play a game. So I can now take out the Saudi players. We don't need those in anymore. But Jean Nicolas Besti, we just need to play two games with three Germans. So we can now take out the Bundesliga players and get rid of them. That's good too. Everything else doesn't matter. So now we can actually build a solid squad. I kind of like, I'm kind of content with this to the point where if we like, I, I don't know. If, What's McCabe's um, squad requirements? Because we might be able to do her. 84, 85, 86. And requires team of the week's team of the forms. Not going to be able to do that. And Yomi, however, we could do 100%. Now, she's got quick step, acrobatic, power shot, a decent card, and another German Frankfurt player, which could just be good in, in general. That's an 85 rate squad. Yeah, what is Udol? Two squads. 85 and an 86. He might be the one. We'll do him first, because I think it makes the most sense. Oh, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Before we submit this at all, this, it does require a team of the season or a team of the week. But I could get all three of these, and one of them is a left back. Are you sure about that? See about getting ourselves a team of the week. Oh, this, this, could, be, this could be banging, to be fair. That is one in form done. We might need three informs, but we'll take it one step at a time because we're still going to accumulate cards and packs whilst we play through here anyway. Obviously, the higher rated the inform, the better because it's going to reduce the price of actually completing the EFL player. And I could use Erdegaard if needs be because we've got some other real cool midfielders anyway. Right, that is the first one of this player pick done. Who is the first person that we're going to take? I feel like it's got to be the guy that plays left back. Because that's the position that we need the most. Oh, we don't have a left back. It's a it's a right back, centre back. And then a centre mid. So I guess then we'll take Gray. Because we do need that right back. 
We should, be, we should be able to get all three of them. Anyway, let's get another team of the week. Hopefully, we get a really high rated team of the week here. It would be nice for us. All right, that is a second inform. Now, in the name of just getting all three of these players, I don't know if I need all three. I don't know if I need the midfielder, you see. Wow, 89 Dybala. That is massive for us. Pop 89 Dybala in here. Throw in, start with just this low rated stuff and we'll try and go for a bit more. All right, this is number two done. Yeah, see, I feel like even though I've got Havlovich, I feel like Edwards will be better because he's going to have better chemistry. And he's also got a beast of a card. You know what as well? Erdegaard is not a good card. And so we will just use Erdegaard in here. I don't know what league he's in. England 3. So he might actually get full chemistry to connect with Edwards as well. Worst case scenario, up now looks like this. Erdegaard comes out of the team and Apta goes in there. And he does. They all, they both get full chem. Havertz full chem. Nabry full chem. Royce full chem. Dunst, we want to boost chemistry a little bit. He's full chem. We're going to need a new left back. That's that's the, the priority now is the left back. And so it's very possible that we do go and do that Udol card. That's not a bad little trade-off, to be fair. But the first half of Udol being done, I don't think I could do the 85 rated squad yet. So we're, we're, gonna, we're, just, we're just going to go and play right now. That'll do. That'll do for now. The purpose right now is not to, like we're not really in a we're not looking to do anything other than just get qualified as quick as possible. Um, so getting these four wins is like priority number one. Yeah, they played really well last time out. He's in behind. How the hell is he scored that? And good sir, delivering. One more. Oh dear, my two players have all my, my two players have just taken themselves out there. That's fun. He's so accurate with the way his team passes and moves. It's like it's just really, really peculiar. Oh, you're joking. Go to the next one. Not gonna be an easy game. This guy was running all over the place. He didn't know where to go. Never. Never a foul. That is the easiest free kick for this guy as well, man. Told you. So easy to score from, man. Come on. Come on. I really need to set some tactics up. Already in champs qualifiers, it's like wildly different compared to uh, rivals. Come on, Royce. Let's go. Let's go. I'll take a bit of cheese. I'll take a bit of cheese. Two wins. Two more to go. Oh, none of this sold. That's wild. But that means... Who is the left back that I was going for? I'll just go and get that left back anyway, because I think that was a good shout. Here we go. All right, into the next game. The team's getting there. Well, as I say, once we get uh, qualified for the weekend league, so two wins to go, then we'll do chem styles, tactics, and and get like kind of like a finalised team for pushing up to 11 wins. Come on, boys. Let's go, baby. There we go. In Kai with a goal as well. I know he's uh, just an 82 rated at the moment, but he's been poor, poor. He's selling. He's selling. Guys, if this guy makes it 3 3, I'm just going to back out. He's in the stream. This guy's in the stream. Goodbye, Dick. Former England forward Sue Smith. And this for the lead. That's got to be a pen. I mean, that has to be a pen. Thank you. It should have been a pen beforehand. I don't know how it wasn't. That was mad, wasn't it? Mad. Come on, Royce, baby. Let's go. Lovely. Lovely, jubbly. It, even, it just really doesn't matter anyway, because the whole point of that account now is just to grind the Arsenal side of things. It's not, not for anything else. 
Oh, let's go. That's an absolutely insane header. I didn't aim it to him either. There was somebody running in just behind him. It was a good win. We have done. In fact, we have got already a couple of extra upgrades. We've got Milinkovic Savic. Oh, he's going to be good. And we've got Jean Nicolas Beste. He might be good. Has he got set piece plus? King pass plus, tiki taka, finesse shot. Oh, he's good. Uh, we can go and do the daily email of the season login again. And then that will give us another little. All right, A1 by two. Here we go. Bad, bad, isn't it? We want to be able to finish off Udol here so that we can sell the left back. These aren't the best packs, but you never know. You never know. We might get a little something, something. Well, nothing major out of those. Right, it's really important that we go and get qualified for champs now as quick as we can. We have improved the club a little bit. We've got Milinkovic Savic over Goethe. Best day over Havertz. I will still try and Evo Havertz, but I kind of don't really need him, do I? I only need one more win and then I'm going to be throwing the rest of the games anyway. That goal. Need to sort out my corner tactics and stuff as well. So that it's only uh, two players in the box there. Having Best Day and SMS, I know I know they're two uh, objective cards, right? The reason why they're so good is because one of them has set piece, even though it's only silver, it's good enough. And the other's like power aerial plus card. Milinkovic, oh, he's good. He's good. And that is us qualified. But I think that's enough for qualification, isn't it? Still no? Wait, yeah. Yeah, that that's I've qualified for finals, right? Yeah, I have, yeah. Because it's like look, it's on, on the little thing. I've got that rank. I've qualified for finals. So now we end playoffs. We get rank five completed. Finals qualification, two rares and a small prime. These rares actually could be quite handy for, for consumables for hunters and shadows. I will take any hunters and shadows that it throws at me, honestly. Oh, yes, there's one shadow. That's banging. Rare gold pack number two. One shadow straight away is like a nice, nice win. Two engines. That's banging. Right, let's sort out this team. All right, nice. And with that, I get into our first champs game. This is a speed run to 11 wins. So I, I need to make sure I maintain that image in my head of... If it's just not a game that I'm comfortably going to win, just back out. Even if it's just even if it's nil nil after 30 minutes, and I'm like, oh god, this is tough. Give the give the win and back out. Getting a two form is going to be really easy over time. Great. That's that's for the Aussie. That's, that's for Aussie's raid, baby. For those of you that have come over from Aussie stream, what we're doing right here. Is conceding a goal. Go then. Let's go. Come on. That's game one. Game one. Orzio. Aussie pro. You know what I mean? Comes onto the scene. Teaches Nep how to play the game. Twenty and zero. It would. It, it, it would. It would cement Orzio's legacy as the premium content creator gameplay guy right wait hold on i've got to stop talking here because this guy's coming back into this game oh my days he's actually i was five one up no we're good we're good that's game over this guy just should have just backed out though man wasted both our times there didn't he i won and oh though first game first win honestly Orzio is like what i wish i was when i'm playing this game he is so calm when he plays this game. So composed, so level-headed. And like, like I meme about it, but I'm actually not joking. Like, he plays this, oh well. He plays this game and he spends most of the game reading his chat. And he's still like eight nil up against someone. And I'm like, what the actual, I saw him one game, right? He was, uh, he was three nil down in Rivals. And he literally uttered the words, guys, I've got to, I've got to lean forwards now. Like, got to sit forwards and focus now. And by the 60th minute in the second half, it was 4-3 up. And I'm like, this is the elite division. This isn't even like some rando scrub that he's just matched on 
in in champs this is somebody who's like obviously like legit at the game and he's just gone out of his way to sit forwards for 10 15 in-game minutes and turned it around but <laughs> i could only wish oh that's calm that's calm Love that. Love that. That's the best day goal I've scored. Let's go, baby. That's a game. Well, the good news is we're 2-0, which means we can get to the two form, which means the 11 win should be easy. Right, we completed three objectives, apparently. Yeah, look at that. So we get this, this, and this. I need a little bit more for um, Orteze. We've got the Bundesliga daily play stuff done, which is quite nice. I might go and open those packs. Just in case we can get something. So we're, we're just uh, we're just like 100 XP away. Or 350 Well, okay. 350 XP away from getting Teze now. 83 by 2. No blue. Right. Ooh, Alisson. Asimir 89. You know where he's going, baby. Do I put him in the exchange or do we finish Udol? No, nah, we, we can't. We've got to put an A. We've got, for, for, the, for the culture, for the culture, Asimir has got to go into the exchange. Not that, I, not that we actually need... To build the team anymore the team that i've got is now good enough to get me 11 wins i know it for a fact because we're already at two two and oh and that is literally 11 and nine all right here we go no blue belgian courtois all right next games oh bell two mascheranos that's cheating damn not even that great of a team is it no the offside Oh, we'll see. We'll see in this one. This might be one of those ones where we just back out. Can he put it away? Ref, come on then. Marco Royce. Saved. Rebounds. You do not see that in Ultimate Team often, do you? No, oh, man. Come on then. Hey, this Milinkovic Savage has been uh, been very saucy so far. Ow. Let's go, Royce. At last, at long last. Jesus Christ. Oh, it was the best day. He looks like Royce. There we go. And, and I always ask myself the question, right? Why didn't I just play like that in the first place? Why didn't I just play like that in the first place? Why didn't I just behave like that in the first place and score those easy goals? Evolution's challenge completed as well, which is nice. We need to get Havertz upgraded a little bit. So there's a nice big boost on him straight away. All right, three down, eight to go, guys. Eight to go. I'm, like, I'm not at this moment in time quite good enough. Damn, this guy got Rodri red. Uh, quite good enough to uh, get 14 comfortably. Oh, Sir Guy Malinkovic Savage. That's delightful. Lovely, jubbly. More of that, and there's more of that. What a miss that is. I don't know how he got the shot off there. I, I tried to switch to the defender and press tackle, but he just wouldn't let me have it. He's baited me fully there. He did not move his keeper. Well, he did. He moved it to the side that I wanted to shoot. And he just waited and waited and waited, man. I could have just finessed that one to the back post, bros. That's outrageous. He's actually going to score for that. Yes, Milinkovic Savage. Come on. Come on. This is us, baby. This is us. He's making... Is he making more subs? I wouldn't be surprised with how... Look at his Eusebio and Pushkas, man. They've got no stam. And his Van Dyke as well. But still, his Van Dyke is able to make that challenge. As I'm about to pull the trigger, yeah. I mean, we got the goal off of it anyway, but what the f was that pass? He's moving his keeper out of the way at that point as if uh, as if he gifted me the win. Come on, bro. Right, 4-0. 
we're getting to those game like the the, sh the level of games now where i'm like do i just want to go and throw away two or three wins straight away you know what i mean we'll, we'll see we'll see what kind of team we come up against and what kind of player we come up against and if we're just so clearly uh you know in a, in a tough game we'll just back out we'll give the win elo kicks in after five mate i don't know where that rumor's come from brother but that's just not true elo starts at your very first game oh i think this is a cheater i think this is a hacker guys but they've got four team of the year slash team of the yep hacker bronze team right they're gonna be hackers again aren't they what how how have, how have all of a sudden i got two cheaters in a row this is taking too long to load in this is another cheater taking so long to load in amix fc okay it's not cheer they got food foot whiz badge on that's calm okay this is a team that i just should be beating though isn't it I, if I did not score that goal, I would have. He was a cheater, I think. How quickly he disconnected there. We're five and zero, oh, halfway, almost. Well, basically halfway there. All right, Spursy FC. Not giving this guy a win. Just back out, if anything. Yeah, see that team's mad in it. Play this one out a few few minutes. See. Oh, actually, I like the idea of golden goal for a few games. Oh, well, leave my opponent to take part as well and participate, but. Oh, press pass right there, just as he got the tackle in. That's awful, isn't it? Doubly awful. This guy's got such a sick team as well that he will score. If I don't go and put him to bed, you know what I mean? There you go, just like that. Mm, that's nice. That's nice. Nice, let's go. Oh, it's delightful. That's delightful. That is game over. Five more wins to go, guys. Five more wins to go. A10. Oh, nice. An A1 by 11. It'd be so nice if we could get cheeky little, uh, cheeky little tots to put into the team, you know. Good one. Good one. 83 by 2. Blue! Come on! Imagine Ronaldo. <laughs> Wait, double blue. Hold on. Nope, the other one's not an 83 plus. That's Pepe. Pepe team of the season. Nice. It would have very man, mate, if I get chemistry on him, I might start him over Bobby Moore. 81 by 11 here we go. Oh, no. Sick. At least there's uh, no dupes there. Blue's four chemistry, man. That's such a shame. He's got good stats. He, he, he'll be good to like just sub on manager. I need, I need to change the manager's league, but listen, can't be asked. Six and already. I need five more wins. What are we Excellent up against? Another pedal check. Damn, that, that's a big team, isn't it? The, 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 this guy's like 16 plus wins level. Back out there. I don't mind dropping like three or four games in a row. And that's lucky because the next few games were a mixed bag. Now, the reason why we've got such a healthy amount of post-com games here, guys, is because I was arguing with my Twitch chat. I was streaming this, of course. Not all of the people in the chat. And, of, of course, we have mixed feelings and mixed opinions on scripting, handicap, and momentum and such. Um, but quite often when I end up reading some comments about people that think scripting, handicap, momentum, DDA, etc. exist, can't help but bite because it doesn't exist and i know you guys are probably going to have your opinions on it as well but this account if anything proves that it doesn't exist a brand new account where we end up getting a phenomenal return in a short amount of time uh you know we beat some teams way worse than us we beat some teams way better than us and you can see we're seven and two uh in the champs bit right there but one of the things that's always interesting when doing these accounts whether it be an 11 win rtg or when we did the 99 loan rtg is showcasing in a different way than I used to just how easy it is to get a good team in the game this year and how EA don't need to, and I don't even think they have the capabilities to manipulate effectively, efficiently, consistently gameplay in any regard. Um, like considering how many other bugs are in the game, I just don't think they can. And I don't think they need to to get people to the store. I think all they need to do to get people to the store is release a shiny new card. And then people are like, oh my God, I need that card in my team. And so 
One of the things that always happens for me is head loss. And I've been trying to work on it. And that sounds crazy to say because I've been doing this for a long, long, long time. You know, I've, my first kind of FIFA videos were FIFA 19. Oh, no, not 19. FIFA 09. Um, I uploaded a few videos. And then FIFA 10, I started uploading some clubs content. And then FIFA 11 is where I very first began Ultimate Team on YouTube. So obviously that was 13, 14 years ago, FIFA 11. Um, so I've been doing this for a long time. And one of the things I've always had as my biggest downfall flat out is head loss. And head loss for me comes in multiple different ways. Sometimes it's when I'm just being bested in the game and I can't get to grips with my opponent. And so I struggle. And upon struggling, I play worse. I lose my call. You know, you know what you guys know what it's like when you when you're angry or when you're stressed, you make decisions bad and you make bad decisions. And that's the same in this game as well. I'm, I'm not saying I would have won these games if I, if I just remained calm, but I might have. And I most certainly would have given a better account of myself had I not got stressed. So one of the things that gives me personal head loss, I don't know if you guys feel the same or not, is just when I'm in a tough game. And, you know, because the way EA have kind of created this game in terms of, especially in champs, in terms of every win not being as valuable as every loss, you know, if you lose in champs, it can be devastating. You win in champs you might not even go to the next rank you know so the the wins are just far less valuable than the losses and so losing a game gets me stressed gets me frustrated and then i carry that into the next game and it doesn't matter how good or bad my opponent is in the next game if i'm playing on head loss that's that's bad the other thing that gives me head loss which is why this is post com and i'm post coming this like i say like a month after the fact as well so i don't even know what headspace i was in right now but josh would let me know that i was arguing with the chat about scripting handicap and momentum but the other thing that gives me head loss is like arg arguing, right? Like when I'm when I'm streaming, and I, I I either should just stop reading my chat when I'm streaming, or I should just stop streaming important games because when I'm streaming, I want to interact with my chat, right? One of the things that I love doing, one of the reasons why I love this job, why I love creating content, is interacting with people. And when you're live streaming, you get that live interaction. And so when I'm playing games and I'm trying to pay attention to my chat at the same time, first of all, my focus gets shifted, which helps me play worse in game, which gives me head loss. But then when you start losing games, you know, you get those trolls in chat and they come in and they try and wind you up and stuff. And it just works on me regularly. And I wish it didn't, but it does. And so uh, we end up, I think, finishing eight and five here. We've got loan check because a goalkeeper was an absolute pain. We need three more wins to get up to the 11. We're going to see if it's possible. Our team is very good. Let's go. Might take us all our last games to get these wins. We're teetering on that ELO or that form of like, could be stinky, could be good. You know what I mean? We could come up against a beast who's just like on their way up or can't find a match lower. Or we could come up against somebody, some absolute scrub who's just enjoying their time. The problem we have is against players like this and teams like this. I just don't have, I just don't have pacey enough centre backs to keep up. This guy's like the last guy, man. He's bad. Might concede some goals. But defensively, he's just bad. My game just crashed. My game just crashed. Oh, it seems you disconnected off. <laughs> All right. Sorry for swearing. Yeah, this guy ain't got a Scooby-Doo. When we're playing with that team. We started this RTG just today. It's a, it's like a speed run on how quick can we get 11 wins in foot champs. Like, respectively... The answer will be quick. There you go. But would it have been quicker? Probably. Thinking about how I've run the account just even today, I probably could have shaved like an hour or two off of it because we've now got way more players than we need at like the higher level. Played a lot of games on this account today though. Probably about 50 or more. Now win this game. Ball. That's the goal. That's the goal. Come on. More of that. Nice. Sweaty goals, baby. Back pass. What a... See, Ramsdale could never... <laughs> oh, dear. Love that. Love that. Jean Nicolas Beste. Oh, he's gone. Good. That's 10. Okay, I just need one more. Calm. 
we'll play a couple of golden goal games. If I don't score first in these these the next two games. I'll just I'll just back out. Damn, this guy's got glitch devos and all sorts, man. This might just be a sweaty game. He's got he's got a sweaty team. Oh yeah, give me some of that, baby. Hey, this Serge Nabry is so good. It would be just so, wouldn't it, for me to get an absolutely crazy red. Can I just switch into the defender that I want when I want it, man? Not the one after. Okay. Good finish. If he's got that, man. Just like that. Should have done that the last one around. Should have passed it one more. And I would have been in on goal. Ramsdale could never. Ramsdale could never. Ah! Come on. Come on. Never give up. No way. That has to be a red card. Yep. Yes, tuck on that. Now you've got to do extra time with 10 men. Bangs it. Let's go, baby. João Pedro. I have hurts. Of course, it had to be him to score the 11th winning goal in the 111th minute. Oh, just walk it in. Oh, he almost has. Almost. 11th winning goal. Yeah, the goal that won us the 11th game. The 11th winning goal. So, we actually did Kai Havertz off of that. I think we still had one more tab for him to go. But like that chucks him up to a 91. Before we go and throw these last few games and get our rewards, let's take a little breakdown of the stats. Start on the bench. Vinicius Jr. Five games, one goal, five assists. Kai Havertz, 18 games, two goals, one of which was a cup winner and five assists. Zobol Zlai, four and two. Raul Pedro did good, three and one in six. Hoyland got one and one in six. Antonar got ten and two in five. Gertzer got one and six in twelve. Had a check with four. Uh, he changed it for me, honestly. Gray. Now, we used him at right back without a, play, a chem style. That's going to have something to do with it. But truth be told, he's not very good. Maybe if he had a shadow chem style, it would be different. But I didn't like him very much. Uh, Edwards was decent. Uh, I liked him quite a lot. But he did have a chem style on. Bobby Moore is terrible. Uh, absolutely awful. 99 dribbling my ass. He was, he was a truck, mate. Uh, this Davis card was all right, to be fair. I didn't mind him at all. Four-star weak foot is nice. His pace was good. He's got some good passing play styles. He was nice. Uh, Apta was terrible. Uh, I didn't like him at all. Um, Milinkovic Savic was good. Not as good as I would have hoped, but he did get 23 goal contributions in 23 games. And of course, we quit out and disconnected from like three or four, maybe even five of those games. But that's actually a decent return for him. A lot better than I thought, but he wasn't as good as I thought he would be. Dunst was woeful. Um, I thought she would be brilliant. Brilliant in game stats, brilliant play styles, just non existent in this team. Uh, Jean Nicolas Beste was phenomenal. 25 goal contributions in the 23 games, but probably closer to like 17 games. Um, he was brilliant. He was absolutely brilliant. Uh, Marco Royce was also very good. Yeah, look at that. 37 goal contributions in the 32 games for him. And Serge Nabry was the absolute star of the show. He's got 40, no. 59 goal contributions, 35 goals, 37 games, but probably closer to like 31 or 32 games where it counts the actual goals and assists rather than just the game. And he's banging. He doesn't have the play, he doesn't have many play styles, but he is absolutely banging. So with that, let us go and throw some games and get our foot champs rewards. People are so weird. Anyway, let me see these play awards rank five on a brand new account took us about eight and a half hours from start to now brand new account to get 11 wins in champs pick number one 
Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. Mr. Marlon, it ain't worth it. Pick number two. I'll tap Soba and Adeyemi. I'll take Adeyemi. So we took Marlon and Adeyemi as the Reds. We otherwise get an ultimate pack, 50k pack, and an 85 by two. Portugal, Ronaldo. <laughs> it can't be Ronaldo, Nepenthes. Mm -hmm. We'd end up with like, by, if I just discarded all of that and sold the tradable stuff, we'd end up with well over a hundred thousand coins if I sold the other team of the week, the team of the season that I've got as well. So it wouldn't even be that bad. We'd be able to go and buy like some real cool cards. We got a club stacked full of cards as well. We didn't even really like force any objectives. We're ending with a team of the season, England, right back. The double. Uh, oh, it's an eighty-five next to him. Oh, uh, but we get Carl Walker's Peters which is another 20k in the bag. So that's not even that bad, man. That's not even that bad. And that leaves us looking like this for eight and a half hours work. That's all right, man. There you go. And there we have it, guys. Despite me thinking it was around eight and a half hours, it was eight hours, two minutes and 18 seconds in total, which really isn't that bad. And as I said, I do think I could knock at least an hour off of this time myself as well and get there a bit quicker if I did things just a little bit different we will definitely give it another shot maybe in the next season of fc24 content but as always guys thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed it feel free to drop a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and let me know down below how long it took you to get a brand new account for 11 wins in champs